Okay, guys, just as usual, like I said, just it's body weight exercises tonight, so kind of hits hip base. Uh, so we don't need any bits of equipment. Just have a bit of water if you have it as well. Like, okay, so just starting off is easy. Just getting a body weight warm up going, get a, get our heart rates up. Okay, so firstly, just jogging on the spot, and we're going to roll our shoulders forward. So just nice and light on the toes. Let's go. Just keep your posture up nice and high. Keep your chest up. Roll those shoulders. Bring the shoulders over you. Bring the hands over the head each time. And remember to stay nice and light on your toes. Okay, roll them go in opposite direction. That's it. And again, kind of march on the spot. And then we're just going out to the side. And just bring your arms above chest tight. That's it. Last few seconds. Three, two, one. We're going to get into some heel kicks, okay? So again, just try to stay nice and light on your toes. Land nice and soft on the toes each time. That's it. And again, keep your head up. Keep breathing into your nose, out to the mouth. Okay, last few seconds, three, two, one. We're gonna keep wide apart. We're just down to the floor. We're gonna stretch over our head, guys. We're gonna do that for 20 seconds. Ready, three, two, one. Off we go. Okay, nothing too hard here. Just getting loose, loose now. Okay, getting the blood flowing around the body. So just barely fingertips to the floor. Stretch over the head each time. Tense up those glutes as you stretch over your head. Last five seconds. Keep it going, four, three, Two and one. Well done. Hands on the hips. Now you're going to go curtsies. The curtsy, you're basically alternating. Take a step behind. Try to get your knee to the floor. 20 seconds again. Ready? In three, two, one. Let's go. Standing straight. That's it. Yeah. So the front foot always have the toes pointing forward. Yeah. And then just take a step out to the side. So this was great when working on your glutes, the outside of your glutes. Okay. The glute medius. Okay. So downside. Last few seconds, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Next, some fingers cross, interlock, should say. Hands or elbows horizontal. Squat, low squat, and then knee, okay, to the opposite side of the body. Ready? Same thing, 20 seconds, three, two, one, down, and alternate. Sit down, good squat down, push up, squat. Let's get good squats, low, nice and low as you can. Push those knees outwards and up to the elbow. That's it. Last few seconds, finish it out there. Five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna go onto the floor now, guys. So let's go then on the knees, okay? We're gonna do some shoulder taps. So don't go too quick. A lot of times people, you always see people, they're doing it really fast. Slow it down, try to activate the core. So always hands on the floor, shoulders over the wrists, come up into that position. Keep your feet wider than your hands, okay? And then just tap off the shoulders, right? 20 seconds again, three, two, one, let's go. So feet wider in the hands, push forward. You nearly want your hand, your head a little bit past the fingers, okay? So you're reaching out, that's it, okay? So as you tap your shoulder, try to tense up your core. Last few seconds now, finish it out. Squeeze those glutes, four, three, two, and one, well done. Kneeling down now, guys. You're gonna go underneath your body, sweep, and you're gonna give a good stretch to the sides, to the obliques. Same hand, okay, I'll tell you when to swap over, ready? Three, two, one, down to the floor, stretch to the air. The floor, and stretch, good. So you want a big, big stretch up. You wanna feel that nice stretch just around the side of the body, okay? Keep your hips kind of strong, don't let your hips kind of move, dictate, just the upper body you're doing, okay? So last few seconds, four, three, two, and one. Swap it over, guys. Ready in three, two, one. Again, down to the floor. Big stretch. Down and up. Good. Remember, it's just a warm up. This is a dynamic, guys. Just getting the blood flowing. She'll feel herself getting a bit warmer now. Okay. Always a good warm up. It's always key for a good session. All right. Last few seconds. Three, two, and one. Okay. On our feet. Let's go. I'm going to run through our first block. So it's going to take a quick drink. Okay, guys, so starting off tonight, four sets, four rounds, first, um, first block. Okay, so the first block is, just gonna check what I have down. Okay, so first block, first exercise, 35 seconds on. We're doing the crisscross squats, okay? So you, you give your hands and your hips, you can interlock your hands, cross the feet, squat down, alternate each time, okay? So stand 
and try to get nice and low to squat. Okay, like I said, it's only body weight movements, so we're not doing, it's not, it's not, you can go as quick as you want, you can go as slow as you want. It's just like lasting the time. Okay, that's number one. Exercise number two then, we're gonna be on our feet. We're gonna walk it onto the hands, into an interim. We're down on the elbows, we're into a windmill. Okay, like that. And then you're walking back up onto your hands like that. All right, looks easy, yeah? So it's down on the hands, walk it out, elbows into a windmill, okay? And then nice and strong, get back up onto your hands like that, all right? That's number two. Number three, then you're actually gonna stay on the floor. Okay, so I gotta say, so we're gonna stay on the floor. We're gonna do some uh, push-ups, okay? So ideally, I want you doing three second eccentric, the three seconds like this. So it's up and off your feet. Three, two, one, hands off the floor. Push yourself back up off your knees. Three, two, one. Down to the ground, take your hands off the floor. Push yourself up. Okay, you can do it on your knees as well. It is effective, okay, but don't be afraid to get to the floor. So three, two, one, hands up, and then push back off the legs like that, okay? That's the third exercise. That's the hand, sorry. Mine's gone blank. Okay, yeah, so the next one uh, is a bear crawl. So bear crawls like this, guys. I'll show you from the side, you can see this. So you're up, your knees are forward like this, so keep a bend on the legs like this, okay? If you can't feel anything, bring your legs back, okay? And now you can see my back is nice and horizontal. Okay, we're gonna hold it, and then we're gonna shoulder tap, okay? If you can't shoulder tap, just hold that position, hold that plank position. Okay, guys, so that's, that's block one, four rounds. Everything's 35 seconds on, 15 seconds to the next exercise, so 50 seconds in total to the next exercise, okay? So remember, like I said, it is warm. We'll work up a good old sweat. Get that heart rate right up as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so starting off block number one, guys, the squat, crisscross squats, ready to go. 35 seconds on the clock. Remember when you're squatting as well, kind of keep shoulder width apart. So if you squat and you're too narrow, it doesn't feel right. So you want to be nice and strong and get nice and low to the floor, okay? So 35 seconds to go. Ready? In three, two, one, let's go. Down. Press hard as you can on the floor with your feet. Sit back. Always let your knees keep behind your toes each time, okay? Down. So it's nice and power. You're pushing up from the floor each time, okay? Down. That's it. And once you get your coordination, just keep going then, fast as you can. Like I said, I, I can't see what you're doing. So you can go as quick as you want. You can go as slow as you want. Last five seconds. Four, three, two, and one, well done. Okay, 15. So remember the inchworm walkouts, then into the L, windmills, back onto the feet, ready? We're going in five seconds. So five, four, three, two, one, 35, go. So down into the windmill, windmill, and then you're using your hands, you're using your, get your back up on. Try not to bend your knees too much going out. So down on the elbows. Into that windmill. That's it, guys. And then nice and strong, come back up on your feet. Take a breath. Straight back down again. That's it. Change it up if you can. So don't keep going down on the same hand. You have a stronger side always. Last one. Do it really quickly. Down. Elbow. Elbow. I'm going to stay on the floor, guys. Okay, well done. So kneeling now. Remember the eccentric push-ups, okay? So... Eccentric is down, concentric is coming up. So we're trying to focus on the eccentric. Okay, so three seconds down. Ready, let's go. Straight into it, go. So three, two, one. Hands off the floor, push back up. Three, two, one. And push. Three, two, one. Hands off the floor and push up. Keep your elbows in nice and tight. Three, two, one. Hands off, push up. Three, two, one. Hands up and push. Go, guys. Keep going. Three, two, one. We have 10 seconds left. You really feel this in the chest. Three, two, one. And push. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. And relax. Well done. Okay, good to work. Last exercise, guys. The bear call, remember? So on your hands, bend your knees, okay? And remember, imagine there's loads of stuff on your back, loads of plates or whatever. Trying to keep them on your back, okay? So ready? Up we go. Let's go. So into that position, 
Move around your legs until you feel it. Okay, you should really, really feel in your core. Okay, keep a bend on the legs though. So bend your knees coming forward. Okay, this set I'm just going to hold it. All right, and then the next set I'm going to do the shoulder taps. Set two and four of shoulder tap. So you should really feel this, guys. Like I said, play around with it. Okay, hold it there. Ten seconds more. Keep your feet wide apart. You should be shaking. Last four, three. Two, one, well done, and relax. Okay, good job, guys. Grab an old tail. Like I said, it's gonna be a sweaty one. It is warm, okay? And like I said, body, body weight exercise. I know the last while everyone's doing body weight exercise, that's thought you'd probably stick to that, but they are really effective when you, when you pick the right ones together, okay? So let's go, set two. Squats again, the crisscross squats, ready? Three, two, one, go. Remember, shoulder width stance, normally into your squats, guys, okay? Legs strong as part of the body. Well out for the heavy duty work, okay? So, as many as you can do. Get nice and low in those squats. 15 left. That's it. Get as low, push those knees out each time. Last five to go. Ready? Four, three, two, time. Well done. On your feet, stay up. Okay, inchworm walkouts, elbows, windmills, back on your feet. Okay, guys, we're going in five seconds. Keep breathing. Stand up to your, breathe to your nose, out to the mouth each time. Three, two, one, let's go. So you use the floor, spread down, spread the floor, that windmill. As you're windmilling, keep your core tight. Don't let your hips move, shake side to side. So keep your feet always wide apart. Okay, so down, two, and then you're nice and strong. Coming back up. Like I said, if you need to bend your legs, do it, but try, try not to as best you can. Okay, last one. Right, in windmill, and up. Okay, good stuff, guys. Next one. Back to the floor, kneeling. Our kneeling push-ups again. Remember, three seconds to the floor, hands off the floor. Push back up nice and strong. Ready, five seconds, four, three, two, one. Off we go. Number three, two, one. And push. So you're pushing up off your knees. So get that body right into the floor. Push back up off the knees. Two, one, hands off the floor, push up, keep the arms in tight. Three, two, one, push up. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Hands up and press, guys. Nearly there. Three, two, one. And we'll get one more in. Three, two, one, and relax. Okay, guys, good work. Again, bear crawls. Okay, so remember if you, if you can shoulder tap, do the shoulder tap. If not, just stay in the, that hollow position. Okay, let's go. Three, two, one. So up we go. Remember knees, bend your knees. Okay, and then I'm gonna shoulder tap. So take your time doing the shoulder taps. If you're doing these, keep forward. And don't let those hips move side to side. So squeezing the glutes. And remember taking your time. Stay over those wrists. Keep a little bend on those knees, guys, remember? Think of your back. You want that nice horizontal shape. 10 to go. That's it, five to go. Four, three, two, and one, well done. Okay, well done, guys, just two down. Take a quick breather. Get your water on board. All right. Okay, guys. We're going well. Set three. Ready to go. Going in three, two, one. Off we go. Set three. Yeah. Well, guys, we're already. 
15 minutes into the class already, so we're flying through it. Just keep going, it'll be over before you know it. It's 100% effort each, every, every exercise you're doing. Keep going. Last few seconds, finish it out. Right to the bell. Four, three, two, time. Well done. Okay, guys, good work. So on your feet, remember, stay up nice and tall. Breathe your nose, out to the mouth. Okay, ready? Inchworms. Three, two, one. Off you go. Up, take a breath. That's it. Let me try to switch it up. Down on my left now. That's it, guys. Keep it up. Come on. Use the floor. Get down. Inchworm. A windmill. And then back up nice and strong because you're using your core each and every time. Okay, well done. That's 35. Down we go. Push ups again. Remember, focusing on that three second down. Okay, guys, ready in five, four, three, two, one. 35 seconds, let's go. Hands up off the floor, push up strong. Three, two, one. Hands up and push up. Good. Two, one. And press. Remember, if you didn't lose on the knees, stay on the knees, don't let the knees come off the floor. Okay, hands up off the floor and push up off the legs. Three, two, one, and press. And again, three, two, one, and press. Okay, good work, guys. All right, into our bear crawls again. So just that plank hold. Okay, ready? Going to five, four, three, two, one, up we go. Remember, hands, shoulders over your wrists. Bend those legs. Keep a bend on those knees. And you should really feel this in the core. If you're not feeling the core, bring your feet just a little bit back and keep a bend on the legs. Keep the hips high. Okay? And squeeze as tight as you can. Squeeze your stomach. Squeeze those glutes. If you're feeling a shake, then you're doing it right. If you're not feeling a shake, then you're not doing it. So move around a bit. Last five, four, three, two, and relax, hold well on. Okay, good job guys, with three down, okay? One left. Okay. Okay guys, hope we're doing good. Hope we're getting through, it is a tough class. Well, I hope it is, <laughs> but uh, hope you're getting on all right, okay? So like I said, if it's anything's too difficult, just play around with it, okay? So, you know, squats are too hard, slow it down. The interims, use your knees if you can, bend your knees. Again, use your knees for your uh, push-ups. And then the last one, then just try to hold it. Just do your best. <laughs> Can't really say anything to more of that. Okay, last set, let's go, ready? 35 on the clock again. We're going in four, three, two, one. Last set, guys. Go. Use your core, guys. You know, squatting's a brilliant, it's a full body exercise. You know, you're using very much your abs here when you, every time you squat down, you're pushing up from the floor. And you kind of jumping into that squat. That's all power. Okay, so damn. Last five to go. If you finish it in five, four, three, two, time. Well done. Okay, good work. Ten seconds, then we're going. Last set of interims, okay? Remember, stay strong. Use the floor. Three, two, one. Let's go. On those elbows, into that windmill. And then take your time getting back up. Take a breath, straight back down again.
I know they're tough guys, but great, great exercise. The heart rate should be through the roof. Doing these. Okay, last few seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Well done. Okay, good job. All right, then we go again. Push ups. Last set of these guys. Remember, three seconds down, hit the knees, get up straight again. No break. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. Three, two, one. Hands off. Push up. Three, two, one. Hands up. Push. Two, one. I'm still with you guys. I'm still, still doing it. Okay, yeah, keep going, push up. Last two, come on. Last one, and press. Okay, good work, guys. Okay, last one, bear crawls. I'm gonna do the sh like shoulder taps again, so remember, second and fourth set, gonna try the shoulder taps, okay? All right, but if not, just stay in that position. Just remember, say, play around with it. Once you feel the abs, feel the shake. Be doing all right. Okay, ready? Last one. Three, two, one. Up we go. Okay, into position. The knees actually kind of stay quite low to the floor. Okay, nearly in line with your wrists. That's how low you want the legs. Keep over those wrists. Last ten. Just hold, I'm gonna hold in the last few seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one, well done. Okay guys, great work. Block one done. It's roasting. Okay, so, take a, take a rest for two seconds, okay? And we're just gonna finish into block number two. Okay. Okay, so. Next block, guys, is nearly 25 past the okay, case. So we're nearly done. Okay, so we're going to do his last kind of 10 minutes. Uh, what we're going to do is the one and a quarter squat. We get into body weight exercise. Okay, um, so the one and a quarter squat from the side. So basically, just you now we did a load of squats today. So it's down, come up a day, back down, and up strong. Okay, so it's down, come up a little bit, back down, and it's that squat position. Okay. Really good exercise. Um, again, it just really gets the heart rate up. Okay, so that's number one. Number two, then, we're going to do some hollow holds, they're called. Okay, so we're down on the ground, lying on our back. And basically, first thing to do is use a killer. <laughs> oh, I'll probably regret doing these. Okay, so you're going to hold, lie down flat, lift your legs up 90 degrees, arms up like this behind your head. Imagine you're holding like a football behind your head. And then straighten out the legs. Imagine you keep holding that football, okay? So that's the position you need to be in. All right, it's killer. But it's probably one of the best uh, core exercises you can actually do, okay? Because it's constant tension on your uh, abs, okay? So it's lie flat down. Okay, so lift the legs up, ele elevate the legs 90 degrees. Imagine you're holding a football behind your leg, behind your head, and then straighten out your legs, okay? All right, so good luck with them. And you're in like a little hollow hold, okay? So that's where they get the name, all right? So we're going to do that, we're going to be on our feet then, and the last one then, get a good, good hit, hit uh, exercise, they are called, I think we've done them once or twice, they're called snowboarders, okay, so you know if you're on a snowboard, you're kind of, you're changing direction each time as you go, okay, so basically, face one corner, have your feet in a diagonal stance position, okay, your hands to the floor, and then you're, you're kind of jumping side to side, okay, stay nice and low, Stay nice and low, and you're actually turning your wrists, you're turning your hips, should I say, when you're, you're moving, okay? So you're actually moving side to side. Try not to come up, try to stay nice and low to the floor, okay? Because then it's just going to really hit your legs nice and strong, nice and hard. Okay, guys, so 25 past six. We're nearly done, okay? So we're just doing these. We're going to do three rounds of these, okay? And then we'll just do our stretching and warm down, and we're done for this evening, okay? So we're going to do the one and a quarter squats, okay? Ready to go. Remember, so it's down, up a little bit, push back down, stand up straight, okay? And I might then, the second set, we're gonna do uh, prisoner squats, but it's the same kind of thing. 
So we then come up a little, back down, stand up straight. Okay, so ready? Uh, starting three, two, one. Let's go again. Just down, push down, up, tense those glutes, come up. Just down, squeeze those glutes nice and strong. So it's up a little, back down, up and squeeze, okay? Down, pushing up, good. So tighten up, tighten up those quad muscles, guys. I just squat and tense them up, good and hard. Squeeze your glutes, come back up straight. Okay, keep going. Down, up, squeeze. Nearly there. Keep going. So your feet shouldn't be coming off the floor. Your feet should be really flat on the floor. Last five seconds. Four, three, two, one, and time. Well done. Okay, down we go. Like I said, these are very, these can be really tough. We just do your best, okay? That's all you can do. Okay, so down we go. All right, so lie flat, look up at the ceiling. Let's lift our legs, elevate them 90 degrees. Remember, imagine hold the foot behind your head. Straighten out your legs, ready? Three, two, one, and hold. Okay, keep those shoulder blades up off the floor. And you should, you should be shaking, guys. So push your lower back down hard into the floor. Just keep those legs straight. Imagine you have a heavy foot up behind your head. 10 seconds, hold it out. Come on, I'm doing it with you. I feel this pain too. Hold it out, five, four, three, two, and relax, well done. Okay, guys, good job. On your feet. You should feel like lots of people say, oh, I feel that my lower back. Just aim to keep your lower back pushed hard into the floor, okay? It's not going to do any damage to your back. It's just a weakness in the core, okay? So that's lot, most people have a lower, weak lower back, okay? So just don't worry about it. Just try to tense those lab muscles as tight as you can. Okay, the snowboards, guys. It's ready to change direction each time. Three, two, one. Go. And we stay nice and low. Change your feet position each time. Okay, so then, and you're turning each time. That's it. So jumping in midair, you're actually jumping off. Your feet leave the floor. Okay, I like to just use my fingers, tap my fingers off the floor as I land. Last few seconds. Finish it out now. Five, four, three, two. Time, well done. Okay. Good work, guys. Two more sets, okay? Two more, then we're done. All right, so we're going one and a quarter again. Remember, one and a quarter squats. Ready to go. Five seconds. Ready? Four, three, two, one, and go. These are probably the easiest ones, as you can see. They're still effective, like, you know, you're still, you can never do enough squats. Sit down, come up, back down, squeeze those glutes at the top. Take a little pause at the top, squeeze, straight back down, and up. That's it. Ten to go. Drive those hips back. Squeeze those glutes, last one. Down and up, well done. Okay, back to the ground, back to those hollow holes. You said they're horrible, but very effective. Okay, let's do it. Come on, two more sets, then we're done. Right, so legs up, hands behind the head. I should hold my football and straighten out those legs and hold those. Don't move those hands. Just look at the point in the, in the ceiling. Okay, hold it over the lower back. So shoulder blades off the floor into that hollow hold. Come on, guys. 10 seconds some more. I hope we're all doing these. They're killer. Five seconds, four, three, two, and relax. Well done. Okay, good job. On our feet. Okay, guys, ready for the snowboarders? Second round of these, going in five, four, three, two, one, off we go. And so looking at the floor, stay looking at the floor and turn that to turn where you want to land, you know? 
Put your, turn your head to that position where you want to land on the floor. Time to go. Come on. Stay low in it. Keep low to the floor. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Well done. All right, guys, we're there. We're down. Last one. And we're finished. Okay, so grab some water. Okay. Last set. Make it a good one. Then we're done. Okay, so. Ready to go? Okay, guys, five seconds and we're done. Ready? Four, three, two, one. Last set, go. Up a little bit more. Back down. Up. Squat. Up. Back down. Squeeze those glutes to the top. Push. Keep driving those knees out. Imagine your kneecaps going towards your baby toes. So out that direction. Good. 10 seconds. Come on. Just finish it out now. As many as you can do. Push. Last one. Three, two, and one. All right, guys. Last hollow hold. Let's do it. Then we go. Lie down flat. Okay. Compose yourself. <laughs> Ready? So legs up off the floor. 90 degree bend in the legs. Toes pointing upright. Hold the ball behind the head. Straighten out the legs in three, two, one. Go. Shoulder blades off that floor. Try to keep them up off the floor. And try sinking lower back into the floor, guys. You should be shaking. You should squeeze those abs as tight as you can. Come on, hold it out. Last 10. Keep going. Shoulder blades up. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Oh, God. Oh, well done, guys. Right, so nearly done. Okay, so. Very good. Practice them at home. Okay. Like I said, there's not many better uh, ab exercises than those. Ones. Okay, so they're really, really good. Okay, guys. Last snowboarders, then we're finished. Okay. Let's go. Three, two, one. Finish it out now. Fast as you can. Just keep tapping the floor. Keep changing your feet position. Never keep your head down. Keep looking where you're turning. That's it. Come on, we're nearly there. Finish it out. Last 10 seconds, then we're done. Fast as you can. Keep turning. The legs like lead. Keep going. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, guys. Great work. Okay, good job. Oh, told you it was a. Hope you found that tough. I definitely did. <laughs> Thought that was a tough old session. Like I said, body weight exercise is very effective when done right. Okay, so great work. So let's get, let's get our breath back. Okay, so stand up tall. Breathe through your nose. Out your mouth. And again, breathe through your nose. And then out your mouth. Okay, guys, sit. Stretch. We'll interlock our fingers. Arms up straight over the head. Looking up. Keep your arms close to your head. All right, hold the stretch for five seconds. Five, four. Three, two, and one. Lean out to the side. Hold it there. Five, four, three, two, one. Swap it over there and lean over to the side. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, overhead, hand overhead. Hold the elbow and hold the back of the shoulder. Your shoulder blades, your scapula. Hold it there. Five, four, three, two, one. Swap it over there, guys. And again, hold it there. Five, Four, three, two, and one. Okay, roll those shoulders over the head. Big rotations. Five, four, three, two, one. Backwards. So five, four, three, two, one. And again, side to side. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, we'll do our legs. So quad stretch. Okay, hold there. Try to get your heel up against your glute. Okay, bring your knee back. And hold that stretch for five, four, three, two, one. 
swap leg and again and hold that stretch hold it there for five four three two and one okay guys feet together take a step out to the side keep your feet on the floor and then lean out to the side hold that stretch for five that's a four three two one and push the other way hold the stretch for five four three two one stay wide stay feet so get your hands to the floor if you can keep your feet nice and wide sit the hips back and then just touching the floor kind of touch at the front touching the, in between your feet then switch behind it, your feet if you can so front middle back that's it keep the legs locked out remember sit the hips back you're going to feel a good stretch on the inner leg and behind the knees last one all right work stay in that position keep your feet wide and you're going side to side so kind of shifting your hips side to side 10 seconds now eight seven six five four three two one well done last one then just cross your feet at the front okay hands over the head guys and then straight into the floor and tuck your chin into your chest hold the stretch five four three two one and last one for tonight guys cross them over arms up overhead and again down tuck your chin into your chest hold the stretch there for five for four three two and one Okay, guys, listen well done today. We are done. Hope you enjoyed that one. And I will hopefully see you again soon. Okay, so all the best, guys.